round chair <laughs> square pillow. That's a dilemma for me. <laughs> yeah, you know, I, I've discovered, as with most of my DIY projects, that it stems from me not being able to find what I'm looking for. And currently, I have been looking everywhere for round chair cushions. <laughs> so, clearly, I'm going to have to make my own. Yeah, currently, you know, I, I have. I've been on a quest to find some round <laughs> seat cushions for that table and chair set. But unfortunately, apparently, they're not being sold anymore or something. I don't know. I just know I've gone to Home Depot, Home Goods, Ross, uh, let's see, wherever, uh, Big Lots, <laughs> yeah, the Goodwill, thrift stores. Nobody's selling them. So clearly, I need to make them. And, well, you know, <laughs> my first stop is going to be the 99 cent store where you can find anything, really. <laughs> Paper plates. Hmm. They wouldn't make good cushions, but <laughs> no, I guess I just figured it out. I need to find two round objects, perhaps, <laughs> and glue them together and stuff them with something. <laughs> so... Yeah, I'm going to head over to the 99 cent store and see what type of round objects I can convert into pillows. <laughs> I think I figured out what I'm looking for. Placemats, perhaps, because, yeah, <laughs> they're kind of comfy, and I could just glue the edges, and yeah, but, yeah, they got to be round, though. I'm looking for something round, like this. <laughs> But yeah, that would, that would hurt to sit on. <laughs> Currently in my bedroom, yes, I, I did all of this to my blanket. <laughs> and, uh, you know, this is a heart pillow, the shape of a heart. And I bought it like that. So, you know, I'm guessing I can find something round. I did, of course, add all the bling to it. <laughs> but it occurred to me, you know, if, if I don't find anything that is round at the 99 cent store that I can glue together and stuff with something, then my next option, or only option really, is to find something I can cut into a round object and then glue that together and stuff it. <laughs> okay, so I just got to the 99 cent store. Hopefully I can find something round that I can stuff. <laughs> Lots of pillows here. <laughs> Yeah, I'm looking for round pillows though. Yeah, round ones, but these are nice. Hmm. I could cut these into circles. <laughs> They're foam. <laughs> oh, dog seats. Maybe this will work. <laughs> so you've even got a little padding already. It's already round. I would just have to glue it to another one and stuff it. Maybe a little more. Be a big seat. <laughs> okay, putting that back. <laughs> I don't know. This definitely seems like this might be a good option. <laughs> yeah. $1.99, two bucks. It's already cut. It's already padded. Pretty much you could just slip it over the chair just like that. I don't know. I, I may have to go with this. <laughs> All right, I'm not seeing any placemats. Okay, now this is a drying mat. Feels pretty good, actually. It can be cut into a circle and glued. <laughs> another option, another option. Found some circle doilies, but that won't quite do it. Not quite big enough. <laughs> we could probably cut these in a circle, but I really don't want to <laughs> this against my tush. Okay, unfold it. This drying mat. I could just cut the corners off and glue it. And that feels pretty good, actually. Technically, I could make the pillows two different colors. <laughs> you know, one on one side, one on the other. Okay, now I go ahead and buy two of these. <laughs> just because if I can't make it with these. I could definitely just cut a V right here and just slide it over there. Okay, this is about the size of the chair. Let's see. <laughs> I'll put 
put this upside down over it. <laughs> yeah, it really does seem to work. <laughs> well, I don't know. I might have to just... Yeah, I might just have to go with this. <laughs> I don't know. Technically, this could work too. But... I, this is already pre-shaped, pre-formed, pre-stuffed. <laughs> well, at the most, I'm going to have to do is cut a V right there. So I'm going to go ahead and go with this. <laughs> Oh, these are perfect. <laughs> Too bad they're so small. <laughs> but yeah, those, that would be perfect. Hmm. Okay, this is round and about the same size as the chair. <laughs> Let's see, does it fit in there? It does. <laughs> yeah. Dog bed wins. Hmm. Sheet. <laughs> Cut them in circles and stuff them like pillowcases. Hmm. <laughs> Perfect for making a poison ivy costume. <laughs> yeah, this is what I use. <laughs> yeah, I always pick up a few fake flowers while I'm here. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so I went with dog bed pillows. <laughs> Let's see if it works. I think it will. <laughs> Time to see if this is going to work. I have a feeling it will. Alright, take this off. That's round. That's round. Let's see, does that work? Uh, a little small. Yeah, a little small, but at the same time, it works. <laughs> Let me sit on it. Uh, yeah, it's okay. Um, you know, I can put a little string around it. Maybe add a little more padding. Yeah, I think I'm going to, like, glue... A little more padding just in through here but the shape is good the shape is real good <laughs> let's see yeah I can stuff this with a smaller pillow square one okay uh, actually that feels pretty good <laughs> yeah I'm gonna stuff it but the shape is perfect. All right, just remove the tag. Definitely not going to be a pet bed anymore. <laughs> I'm going to make this super easy on myself. <laughs> I just realized I have some spare pillowcases. I can just fill these up with this. All right, I'm just going to put some of this and this. <laughs> Instead of tying it in a knot, I actually figured out if I use a rubber band, <laughs> that works really well too. Rubber bands are, you know, very effective in doing stuff, holding stuff together. Ta da! <laughs> All right. Let's see what happens. It's gonna work! Yep. <laughs> Simple, easy, cheap. And now I've got some round pillows. Okay, they're actually dog beds, mini dog beds that I found at the 99 cent store. But they will definitely cushion my butt <laughs> when sitting on that chair. Yay! I think it's going to work. Let's try it out. It's starting to get a little windy. <laughs> okay, let's see. The tree test. Round. Round. <laughs> Try to sit down. Oh. It works. It's comfy. <laughs> yeah. Who would have thought, huh? But uh, sometimes you just can't find what you're looking for, you know? So you got to make what you're looking for. Or at least 
somehow make something that'll work <laughs> like what you're looking for and uh, yeah mini doggy beds found at the 99 cent store <clears throat> a pillowcase <laughs> rubber bed and some stuffing and I found or managed to get what I was looking for <laughs> if I really wanted to I guess I could make some string velcro or whatever go around the edges here but <laughs> Yeah, it works. It's a tad high, but it's definitely going to flatten, so, over time. But I think, <laughs> considering I couldn't find what I was looking for, this works. Yep, the wind is returning. So I definitely don't want to be spending a bunch of money on decor. But I have, I think, figured out my next project. <laughs> Just by looking at this carpet, yeah, I'm thinking that burgundy or the green color, maybe. Pillowcases. And put these inside the pillowcases. Like the really long king cases. And then maybe sew them together or whatever. And they can just have one long cushion there. Yeah, that might work. <laughs> so just the little pillows. But with a little color, you know. Yes, most of my decor came from the 99 cent store or the Dollar Tree because it does go flying in the wind here. <laughs> yeah, doggy beds. What a great find at the 99 cent store. <laughs> okay, <laughs> so there you have it. Yeah, if you're, if you're looking for round pillows, cushions, you've exhausted all your possibilities of shopping and you can't find any, then clearly, you know, you're going to have to create one, make one, or somehow make something that'll pass as one, <laughs> like I did. Uh, yeah, I was hoping to find maybe some round pieces of material, placemats or something that I could glue together and then stuff those and make little cushions, but the doggy bed that I found at the 99 cent store, perfect really truly because it was already padded already cut its material and you know just stuffing the pillowcase and then closing it off with a rubber band and putting that in there it worked <laughs> so whatever works basically right <laughs> thanks for watching Okay, so I spent a grand total of $4 to make those round pillows, basically, because <laughs> I had everything else. But, uh, yeah, $1.99 at the 99-cent store. They had different colors, just in case you decide to go with this concept. <laughs> Run, don't walk to the nearest 99-cent store for the ability to make round pillows. <laughs>